How do I know if MP rotators are an option for my landscape? I'm Sprinkler Nerd Andy. You're watching Sprinkler TV. All right, welcome, Kevin. Recording another episode with you. Good to be here. Thanks for having me, Andy. Yeah, absolutely. And Kevin is the regional sales representative for Hunter Industries out of Chicago, joining us today as an authority to answer the question, how do I know if MP rotators are an option? So why don't you take it, Kevin? Yeah, for sure. Um, easiest way to tell, you know, MPs are a high efficiency nozzle that attach to a traditional spray nozzle. So the easiest way to identify a traditional spray head or spray nozzle is when the head comes on, Typically, it's going to omit water somewhere between the range of two feet to 17 feet. And when it comes on, there's not any rotation taking place. So in other words, you see the pattern in its entirety. As soon as it comes on, you're going to recognize this is a 15 foot half nozzle spraying 15 feet, 180 degrees. Um, we play friendly with our competitors. So we make MP rotators to thread onto any traditional spray head that's out there. Once we know it's a spray head, the next box to check is if the distance you're desiring is between six feet all the way out to 35 feet, we have an MP rotator that will fit that gap. So if it's six foot to 35 feet, anywhere from you know 45 degrees to 360, and then we make uh, specialty configurations that'll throw five out the front, 15 to the sides and everything in between. Perfect. So I'll say it because Kevin couldn't. If you have Rainbird sprinklers, if you have Toro sprinklers, if you have Weathermatic sprinklers, if you have K Rain sprinklers, if you have Nelson, if you have Eritrol, you can get an MP rotator to for those existing spray bodies. As an example, this is a Rainbird sprinkler. You can put an MP rotator directly onto that spray head body. Andy, I, th I think I need a minute. I'm getting a little, I, I, I just threw up in my own mouth there for a second. What do you mean? <laughs> All good. Yeah, we play friendly with others. We're in the game to preserve the precious natural resource of water. So versatility of the line is important for us. Um, and it's at our core values. As, as Okay, an great. So when I think of MP Rotator, I think of all these different colors, blue, black, gray, orange, teal, green. What are with all the different colors and how yeah, is somebody yeah. supposed to know what they need? So the, the we Hunter Industries acquired the MP Rotator the same year that they acquired me in 07. And when we acquired it, there was three flavors. You had the 1000, which is about your 15 foot, and they can all be reduced by 25%. So keep that in mind. You had your 2000, which is your 20 foot radius. And then you had your 3000, which is your 30 foot radius. The popularity because of the performance of the MP, um, we began to expand beyond that. And so when you look within each line, so say the 3000 series that sprays 30 feet, there's three different models within each line. This one right here is going to go 90 degree to 210 degree arc. The next one is 210 all the way up to 270. And then we make a full 360 degree. Now, keeping in mind, we make specialty ones. So if 90 degrees is too wide of an area of coverage, we can collapse that down. We have one that's called a corner spray that goes down to 45 degrees. If you have that tight little space between you and the neighbor, we use what's called an SST, side strip. So it's going to spray five feet straight out in front of you and 15 to either side with some adjustability as we know landscapes are not all cookie cutter and boxed. Um, and then beyond that, we've you know, expanded it to the 3500 series. So now we're kind of competing with uh, rotary distance, if you will. Um, and um, I don't know if you want to get into Andy, but... The application rate, we make them sure. uh, the 1000 series. Um, MP rotators match precipitation rate. If it's got a black body on it, the application rate in which it lays down water is about four tenths of an inch per hour. We have another line of MP rotators. The easiest way to tell is if the body is gray on the MP rotator, I believe Andy has one in front of him, then the application rate is actually double. It's four, it's eight tenths of an inch per hour. So black body representation of four tenths of an inch per hour and gray body, eight tenths of an inch per hour. In matching precipitation rate, you don't want to mix the black and the gray together. Um, that's probably one of the biggest missteps um, with MPs or irrigation in general is 
putting product that doesn't have the same application rate on the same zone running off the same terminal at the clock. And now you have really green grass in one area and dry spots. And from an aerial view, if you run your drone, it looks like crop circles. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. Well, thank you, Kevin. We get a lot of questions about the colors, gray, black, blue, green, teal, and there's great resources. We'll link to either the catalog page or Hunter's website right in the comments on this video. So if you're curious, we'll give you a direct link and then you can find the MP rotator that's best for your specific application. Absolutely. And it, you know, it, it looks simple. It looks basic. I wish I had a clear cutaway. There's 21 parts that go into this MP rotator. And in order to match that precipitation rate, there's a lot happening inside of here. Wow. Wow. Cool. Well, thank you so much, Kevin. You bet. And uh, if we can help answer any of your Hunter questions about sprinklers, rotors, valves, controllers, drip irrigation, feel free to reach out. You can contact us by phone, chat, email, and text message. And until the next Sprinkler Supply Store product overview, happy sprinkling. We'll talk to you then.